Yeah, I was so nervous to do this to my hair at first. I'm like, there's no way this is gonna work. There's no way. Feeling like a boss ass bitch these days. Life is more than just getting paid. What's up guys, it's Shanice, welcome or welcome back to my channel. So you already know the deal, if you're not already subscribed, definitely hit that subscribe button down below. So as you can see by the title of this video, this tutorial is all about the wet hair look and I've seen it going all around on YouTube so I thought your girl needs to try this because it looks so freaking bomb. I never thought my hair would be able to do it just because it's super super thick but I think I got it down packed. But y'all can let me know. So yeah, if you guys want to see how I achieved this, definitely stay tuned. Alright guys, so I just hopped out of the shower. And I put my hair into this little bun right here so it could just absorb as much water as possible. Because I didn't want it to dry up. Um, and I did co-wash my hair with the Suave Professional Coconut Oil Infusion Conditioner right here. So yeah, we're just going to get right into this. You want to make sure that your hair is like soaking wet, like all the way soaking wet. And while you're in the shower um, with the conditioner in your hair, just push, push your hair or brush your hair all the way back and try to make sure that there are no tangles because that's really going to help in this process. So I'm actually going to be working in sections starting from the back. So this is how big I'm doing this section right here. I'm going to make sure that it's nice and detangled as well. That's like a major key to doing the style. You wanna make sure that it's super detangled from root to tip. I'm gonna spray a little bit more water. And I'm also gonna be applying a little bit more of the conditioner. This is just gonna make sure that my hair is nice and smooth. So for some moisture and for some shine, I'm going to be using the Jane Carter Nourish and Shine for dry hair and dry skin. So this is like a shea butter type of consistency, but a little bit less thick, I would say. And this is my first time kind of actually using this product. I used it the last time I did this style as well. And I don't know how I feel about it because it kind of just feels like it sticks onto my hair, but it honestly worked for this style. So... I was happy about that and I mainly you know try to focus on my ends just so those can look really nice and shiny and then I'm gonna go in with the star of the show this is the eco style olive oil and shea butter black castor oil and flaxseed gel so we are gonna be using a lot of this gel like we're gonna go ham so I picked up a big scoop and we're just gonna start applying I'm kind of just raking it through my hair like I would do any wash and go. So I'm taking another big clump right here and I'm just going to be kind of applying it to the roots because you want the roots to really, really lay flat. So now I'm going to take my Demon brush right here and I'm kind of just going to press down the roots. Okay, so now we're going to move on to the next section. So I have this chunky section right here. I'm kind of doing medium sized sections. I'm going to spritz with water. Apply some conditioner. Guys, this is almost done. <laughs> and then detangle. And this can get real, real, real messy. So you wanna make sure that you're not doing it anywhere too important. <laughs> I'm gonna take some of the Nourish and Shine. This is such a weird texture on my hair. It just, it feels kind of like dry when I put it on, but it's working. And of course, back into the Eco Gel. Taking a lot of that. So when it comes to this side right here, we're gonna kind of work it backwards because all the hair is gonna be going to the back. So I'm gonna take a little bit more gel and just start kind of brushing it back this way. I 
I'm gonna keep applying gel until like I'm kind of happy with how it looks. Anyways, I'm gonna speed this up a little bit because you guys pretty much get what I'm doing so far. Um, I'm spraying some water, applying a little bit of conditioner, and then I'm detangling. And then I'm going in with some of the Nourish and Shine from Root to Tips and then focusing on my ends. And then I'm applying like a shitload of the Eco Style gel right here, which is so bomb. Like I never knew how good this stuff was until now like I've been using edge control a lot but this is gonna be my new thing my new jam walking downtown and I'm okay he's got it all figured out it's what they all say yeah Everyone's looking at me thinking that I'm different Everyone's looking at me thinking that I'm living But I don't really care what they all say It's easier said than done That guy, got me to live through life But it all comes down to Down and I'm okay. Eyes on me, I don't know what to do, so I smile and I wave. Right. Everyone's looking like they know what they're doing. Everyone's looking like they know what I'm pursuing. I'm trying not to give them the time of day. So I'm just gonna kind of keep combing it back. Now, I'm not going all the way down because that's going to ruin my curls, so. And then we are going to add some more gel. Like for this style, gel is going to be your best friend. It's going to be bae. You're going to use almost the whole jar. <laughs> Especially if you have a lot of hair and your hair is like really thick. So this is how it's looking so far. Um, it's gonna look better soon. So I'm going to actually um, do my edges. I'm gonna just brush it out with my fingers first. I'm gonna use the comb part right here to just, just to kind of get my edges as sharp as I want them to be or to like detail my edges <laughs> and then I also like to use the small part to kind of brush this hair back Okay, so this is how my hair is looking so far. You can kind of see that there's, you know, some white going on from the conditioner and all that, but that is gonna dry clear, hopefully. <laughs> so it's slicked back all the way. Um, this is how the back is looking so far as well. So the next step I'm gonna do is apply some anti-frizz oil right here. And this is just for extra shine, you know? And then the last product I'll be using is the Extra Strength Honey Hold Mega Hairspray. And I'm going to be using this for extra hold and just so everything can stay in place. Ryan Lee. 
edges. All right guys, so to kind of let this hair mold into place and just to hold it down, I'm gonna be using two satin scarves right here to lay my hair down. So first one is gonna be for the edges. This is like a shorter scarf compared to my OG green scarf. And then I'm gonna use my big OG scarf and this is gonna be for the rest of my hair. And I'm kind of gonna make the the triangle part longer just so it can hold the rest of my hair in the back together which you guys will see so I'm kind of being extra right now I don't have to do this I didn't do it last time but I noticed that my hair kind of you know it dried puffy and I don't want that so I'm gonna try to mold it so it dries a little bit more flat by tying this extra scarf around it. Anyways, your girl looks hella crazy, but I'll be back in about 20 minutes and I'll show you guys how it looks. Okay guys, so I am back and I'm about to take this off. It's definitely not all the way dry yet, but you will still get the picture. The moment of truth. Ooh, ooh, okay. This is sticking to me right now. So y'all, this is how my hair came out. And I think it came out super, super bomb. It definitely came out better than the first time I did it just because I was able to lay my hair um, for a longer period of time. So yeah, I absolutely love it. It's gonna be like my, no my new go-to style for the summer. Ooh, and especially with the glow and everything going on, like, yes. So anyways, guys, that wraps up this video. Let me know if you guys are going to try this style down below in the comment section. Let me know what you think about this hair as well. And also, I'll give you guys an update later on vlog style on how, you know, my hair holds up after it fully, fully dries. So, yeah, um, I will see you guys on the next video. I love you guys. Feeling like a boss ass bitch these days Life is more than just getting paid Yeah, you could bet your chips Hoping, wishing, lose it all so quick these days Yeah, this is the gift mama gave me Yeah, this is the week that he raised me And when I get stressed I just remember I'm blessed Ain't no complaining I ain't changing Okay, guys, so I just got in It's about Just so you guys don't think I'm faking, yeah It's 10 o'clock p.m. We went mini golfing, so I was outside for a hot minute and it was super, super humid. Like I was sweating and everything like that, but my hair lasted pretty well. So it's like pretty much dry. I would say about 95% dry and it held up really, really, really well. So yeah, this is how my hair looks so, so far. Well, right now, all the way dry. And it's still holding. I will say that this part kind of lifted like right about here. But for the most part, it's holding up. And I think the major key was using a lot of gel, of course. And then also using the hairspray. And then tying my hair down for at least two hours. Yeah, y'all. This is my hair. Let me not play with it too much. But anyways, guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Definitely smash that thumbs up button, and I'll see you guys on the next one.